Well, hello there, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome back to the channel today. We're back for another recording slash live streaming tutorial here today. And today we're going to be doing an updated tutorial teaching you guys how to live stream from the Xbox One straight to Mixer. Mixer is a up and coming streaming platform I stream on and I'm partnered on. And today we're going to teach you guys how to stream on it from the console directly. And if you guys want to Go make a Mixer account. I also link Mixer to the website down below. As well, if you guys want to go follow me, my Mixer down below as well. Alright, so, first thing you have to do is launch a game. We're going to launch Fortnite Battle Royale here. We're live in it, as you can see, right here. So the first thing we're going to do is click the middle button on the Xbox controller. We're going to scroll over to Broadcast. We're going to click I Agree, Terms of Use of Privacy. We're going to click I Agree. And if you want to view the privacy and tune service, you can click them. I click I Agree. All right, so here you see is YouTube. It's Red Fusion YT. This is obviously I'm using my brother's account, another one of private accounts here. So if you guys want to start a broadcast, you're going to press A on the Start Broadcast button. Let's say we want to change the stream tile. We're going to call this just uh, Fortnite. Uh, gameplay uh, Xbox one. Let's call this Fortnite Xbox one. This is where you can change the title Fortnite Xbox one see the stream tile right there and as well as the mixer link Then we're gonna if we want to change a microphone the only thing we can use as a microphone I believe right now is either the turtle beaches or I don't know if you can actually use an Xbox mic other than the turtle beaches I'm not sure or a uh, connect as your mic Also, you can use a camera that can include a USB webcam or the connect that was obviously updated where you can use a USB as well as you can include the chat on if you press the A button on it you have the chat on and then you also can include party audio if you're in a party with someone and you want to hear and you want the stream to hear their audio you can press A on that as well as if you have a camera set up you can change the camera settings and if you have an overlay for example if you have the chat overlay in you can uh, choose to move it wherever you so please alright then after that you can pretty much click the start broadcast button and it should be live right now and obviously you can pause the broadcast by hitting that and stop it obviously so let's go check and obviously here are some more advanced settings if you want to change stuff up a lot of broadcast and game captures mic on cast things if you want to turn your mic on change the volume of it or the game or system volume as well as a lot of broadcasts and game catchers during the broadcast. All right, so right now, let us go see if we are live on Mixer. We're gonna go search up the name It's Red Fusion YT, and let's see if we are live. All right, so I'm looking it up right now. We're going right on the Mixer website here right in one second. All right, let's go. All right, and as you can see here, who's live right now, Live right now on the website. See, it's straight to live. And once, like I said, it's instant. Press the A button right here. Let's see if that updates. I'm going to go live with it. See? If we move, it like literally you could see from this, this is instant. Literally from my Elgato, this is instant, which is actually insane. So they, it uses a protocol called FTL, which is no delay at all. So once you have that set up, it's pretty cool. But this is just straight from your uh, dashboard on Mixer.com. It works out perfectly. And there's really no worries at all. You've got everything set. And obviously, you can adjust. So let's say, for example, I'm going to pause the live stream. Let's go back and let's try to pause it. Let's see what happens. See, if we pause it, the Xbox thing will hit up this little pause screen. See? And if we click resume... It'll go straight back to the game. So if you ever want to go have a bathroom break, just hit the pause broadcast button I showed you before. And obviously, if you again enable the chat, you can see if someone types in the chat. Um, I don't know if it'll pop up on my Elgato, but I don't think it will. Uh, yes, it will. See, they're right there. If you uh, have someone pop in the chat, I'll use my bot, for example. Uh, I just saw my bot do that. It's pretty cool. And that's just really all you, you know, it'll pop up. Right now, if you go to display and see that right there, right there down the bomb bot says hi. And that's if you enable the overlay uh, for the chat. Now, obviously, if you turn that off, it's off. But that's pretty much all you need to do. If you guys have any questions, please make sure to leave a like and subscribe if you did enjoy this video. But all again, I have to do is hit the broadcast button. You can pause it or stop it if you like. 
uh, microphone, obviously, they use connector turtle baches. Uh, chat, if you wanted the chat enabled, do it. Camera, you only can use a USB or a connect. And party audio, if, again, if you want to include yours or someone else's chat, or your, someone else in your party's chat in the stream, as well as if you want to move the camera or the overlay wherever you so please. And you gotta, the people on the actual mixer stream will not be able to see this overlay. So you see how I see this overlay here on the bottom left? If we go straight to Mixer and check, can they see the overlay? Nope, none of the viewers can see the overlay. Nope, and again, remember that's instant. It literally uses FTL, so there's like really no delay at all. All right, guys, thank you all again for watching. If you did this video, if you enjoyed this video, please make sure to leave a like and subscribe if you are new. And I will see you all in the next video. Peace out.